Colby Sawyer College created this form to report students for COVID violations. The two primary goals are to keep our campus safe and to retain our in-person instruction models. The school cannot say how the reports are handled or how many students have been punished. There are some allegations of, of misbehavior that warrant a quick conversation and reminders. And then there's patterns of violations that you know, put the community campus at risk. Which could result in getting removed from campus and having to learn remotely. Sam Mohammed says that happened to her. We lose our housing because of getting groceries. When she arrived back for spring semester, she says another student reported her for going to the grocery store before starting a two-week quarantine. Her roommate was with her and has also been removed from campus. In the email say, stock up before you start your quarantine. And we thought we were in the limits because we thought that quarantines are the 19th. Mohammed says the school will not return her $8,000 for housing. Administration won't comment on her case. I just didn't think the school would do something that harsh for something that they asked the students to do. Ashley Humphreys created this online petition. We definitely got a huge response from friends, family, students of Colby Sawyer, alumni. They were really powerful, some of the things that people said. So definitely, I hope the school takes it into consideration. That online petition can be found on our website at WMUR.com. Reporting in New London, Kristen Carosa, WMUR News 9.